with the secular vision of rejuvenating empathy and self-realization in people, Sufi saint Khwaja Muhammad Fazal Shah started the journey of spreading love, peace, harmony and knowledge through small philanthropic gestures. He set up a small well in the village Garhi Afghana 200 years ago and this was the beginning of his philanthropic work. His descendants kept his legacy alive by setting up a formal institute known as Fazlia in 1993. With the vision to help the humanity and spreading knowledge amongst the masses, Fazlia opened up a madrasa with merely 22 students in the village Gari Afghana Taxila. इस वक्त जितने भी पाकिस्तान के प्रॉब्लम्स हैं उनको एड्रेस करने के लिए जो बुनियादी टूल है अगर आप इलिटरेसी को इस मुल्क से खत्म करने में कामयाब हो जाएं तो टेररिज्म खुद ब खुद खत्म हो जाएगा पॉवर्टी एलिमिनेट कर जाएगी प्रॉब्लम्स खत्म हो जाएंगे झगड़े खत्म हो जाएंगे फाजलिया ने भी सबसे पहले जो काम शुरू किया है वो एजुकेशन है एंड एजुकेशन इज आर टूल टू फाइट टेररिज्म एजुकेशन इज टूल टू फाइट पॉवर्टी टू फाइट इलिटरेसी and all these problems which we are facing in the country. To combat radicalism and illiteracy, Fazlia laid the foundation stones for enlightened moderation movement by converting the madrasa to an English medium school in 1999. I was one of uh, those people who motivated the government to do this and uh, finally when they took the step, we were the first to join them openly. But the basic idea was of the Fazlia Trust. Fazlia Public Secondary School is now an English medium co-education school, ensuring quality education and boarding facility to 384 vulnerable and at-risk students from remote and poverty-struck areas of the country. Female education at all levels is encouraged and a degree college is fully operational in village Garhi Afghana, Punjab. There is also a girls primary school established in village Sahir Kotli, Azad Jammu Kashmir. Girls entitled for professional education but unable to afford the expense are supported. A skill development centre is further facilitating the women to get economically stable. Marriage supports for girls guarantee the secure future. Fazlia is different from other NGOs because we ensure transparency, accountability and monitoring at all levels. We visit fields and we carry out a beneficiary feedback surveys. We also focus on um, need assessments and then carry out our project. Small but visible high impact and result oriented projects based on need assessment are implemented in the areas devoid of fundamental necessities of life. Community participation is the basic component of sustainable development. Basic health units with life-saving medicines are being managed by Faslia. We at Faslia identify the most deprived victims of malnutrition, health deprivation, lack of education and poverty and then we focus on their needs and requirements. Patients suffering from critical diseases are financially assisted on a monthly basis as well as for different surgical procedures like heart surgery and cornea transplant in the hospitals. I was driving a car before, my car was good. In 2005, my car was a problem. I had to check the doctor, I had to check the operation. I had to check the operation, but I had to check the operation. कमयाबी नहीं हुई। 2500 रुपया जो ये जो देते हैं ना इस्तेमाल तो ये 2500 रुपये से आपको पता है कि क्या आज होता है लेकिन बड़ा लाला का शुक्र है चलो कुछ न कुछ थोड़ा बहुत सोदा वगैरह आदमी ले आता है। 
मैं ये कौन पे जा रहा था बाइक पे तो रास्ते में जाते हुए ये एनक वगैरह हेलमेट वगैरह कुछ नहीं लगा हुआ था तो एक परिंदा आया छोटा सा तो वो मेरी आंख में सीधा घुस गया तीन साल तक मैं मतलब मुतासर रहा मुझे पता चला कि ये एक ट्रस्ट है ये मदद करते हैं लोगों की यहाँ पे मैं गया तो इन्होंने मुझे मतलब डेढ़ लाख का ये चक अलशफा अस्पताल में भेज दिया वहाँ पे उन्होंने फिर डोनेट ये अंक श्रीलंका से तो आज अब मैं अपने पाँव पे खड़ा हूँ मैं काम कर सकता हूँ In the past two decades, the trust has emerged as a leading non-profit organization. Faslia is also running two water supply schemes, a bioremediation plant, a biogas plant, income support programs, free daily kitchen, a dispensary, health support program, rehabilitation and reconstruction of catastrophe affected villages, providing its services to humanity irrespective of religion, race, color, gender and caste. We want to support humanity anywhere in the world, and we hope, very strongly hope, rather believe that uh, the people from all over the world will support us in this cause, and inshallah, we will be working all over the world.